Welcome to the Ramley class of 2028. My name is Lori Mitchell and I am the Student Services Department Chair. On behalf of our team, again, welcome to Grays Lake Central. Let's start by meeting the counselors. We work with students in grades 9 through 12, all four years of high school. We also work with students based on their last name, so please take a moment to familiarize yourself with your school counselor. The course selection process is an important aspect of high school. This is the time to think hard about what you enjoy, what you want to learn more about, what could be helpful to you in your future, and so on. We encourage students and parents to sit together to think about interests and goals and then choose courses that will help achieve those interests and goals. We also require that a parent sign the course selection sheet before the appointment so that we know a discussion about course selection has occurred. Here is a sample of the 24-25 course selection sheet. Core classes, English, Math, Science, and Social Studies are listed first, followed by Life Fitness and Electives. Elective courses are grouped by Fine Arts, Applied Arts, Elective English, Elective Math, and World Languages. There is also another category for students interested in driver ed or those that might need additional support. So the actual course selection sheet lists the core classes for which you are recommended. They will be highlighted on the sheet unless there is no data present. Core class recommendations come from a variety of sources such as PSAT 8, MAP scores, current math class, and or teacher input. Counselors will verify the levels of core classes with students during their individual meetings. The accelerated placement law requires us to place students in the next most rigorous course if certain scores are met on the PSAP. Should you wish to level down, you may do so at the appointment and by filling out the information toward the bottom of the course selection sheet. Please be prepared with elective choices, your preferred choices and alternates, and keep in mind that classes with an asterisk next to them are semester long, so two of these classes equals one choice. So again, we have the four core classes which will be highlighted for you unless there is no data for us to make a decision. All students will have a RAMS block. All students will choose up to two credits of electives, depending on if additional support is needed. We also want students to select two alternate elective classes in the event that one of their top choices is unavailable. Parent signature is required. And if requesting a level down, a separate part of the form must be filled out with a parent signature required as well. The actual meeting will look like this. Counselors will travel to the sender schools, but you might meet with the counselor that is not your actual school counselor as we do not attend all six schools. Parents are welcome, but not required to be at the meeting. These meetings can go anywhere from sometimes two minutes up to about eight minutes. So again, meetings are quite short, so please do not feel obligated to attend, but parents, should your schedule permit, please do attend as we'd be happy to have you present. Any questions about curriculum or placement should be directed to the appropriate department chairperson. Department chairs will be present at the class of 2028 open house night. Here's the schedule for course selection this year. On Monday, January 22nd, all counselors will be at GMS. Tuesday, the 23rd, counselors will be at GMS to meet with students with IEPs, and then we will have counselors at Woodland as well. Wednesday, the 24th, will be Fremont, Prairie Crossing, and St. Gilbert. And then finally, most counselors will be at Park on Thursday, January 25th. Again, course selection is a very important part of the high school process and experience. So please let me know if you have any questions at any time. Again, I am Lori Mitchell, the Student Services Department Chair at lmitchell at d127.org, and I'd be happy to answer any questions that you might have. Please reach out prior to January 22nd so that all are prepared for their course selection appointment.